And so what we saw was that there was a genetic variant that was actually driving their, um, like a lowering of their diastolic blood pressure while they were diving. Um, and so we think that this is protective against these hypertensive or high blood pressure effects. That's interesting. So for non-divers, so for pregnant women on land who aren't from this population, mm -hmm. um, the, the picture I'm getting is that they're sleeping on their back, perhaps because it's more comfortable as, as they get very pregnant, and their their airway is getting cut off mm -hmm. at some point. So right. they're having these hypoxic episodes. Exactly. And then there's some gasping as the carbon dioxide gets high. This is also incidentally what people who are overweight or by the way, people with very big necks. This is why a lot of big necked, very lean men die in their sleep. Hmm. This is a kind of well-known thing in certain sports communities. Okay. It's a very it's very tragic. You know, you say, well, this person's, you know, fit, but they're lying on their back. They, they have big necks and their airway is compressed. Mm -hmm. You have a big neck doesn't necessarily mean you're going to die early, but make sure you're breathing right at night. So because uh, sleep apnea is very dangerous. It is, yeah. I, I think we think like of it as diving. just snoring, yeah. right? right? But it's super dangerous. Yeah. yeah. You're putting yourself into a state of hypoxemia. So mm -hmm. your, your oxygen is very low. So for pregnant women who are concerned about hypoxia, mm -hmm. uh, what are the, what are the um, options that they have besides becoming a diver and you know, joining this incredible community mm -hmm. in, in, in Korea? Yeah, I mean, I think, well, you know, that's one of the things that we're hoping to find from studying these women. So if they've evolved some kind of protective mechanism that protects them in the case of apnea, maybe that's something we could develop into a therapeutic that could be used to help prevent that same, uh, you know, hypertensive disorder pregnancy in pregnant women who have apnea for other reasons. 